Hello folks, this is Audiotron 1003 and today is another uh, vintage Lego haul uh, from eBay. I think I know who the seller is but I'm not sure so what I'll do is I'll wait until I've opened the parcel and then give credit to that individual seller. So um, I can feel that it's in a box inside a padded jiffy bag. So uh, what I'll do is um, I'll uh, open this and reveal what's inside and uh, here it is it's the uh, Lego set 622 um, I believe it's the um, uh, baggage um, cart set or luggage cart set from the from the early 70s with a uh, brick built uh, representative of a representation I should say of a uh, minifigure long before even I suspect the hands in pocket minifigures came out so um, what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll have a look at the box and here it is it's in very good condition for its age there's the uh, symbol showing the mini wheel um, logo some kid playing with it and a demonstration of the uh, couplings and uh, this is the Legoland top, the side, or over the end, and the bottom picture showing you um, what it is. So uh, I suspect um, it's probably wrapped in something. Yes, it is. Sometimes these sets come built, and sometimes they're but just in uh, bits and pieces. And I think that's what's, what's happened here. I'm trying not to make too much mess. Um, what I'm really trying to do is tip all the pieces out uh, without sort of creating too much hassle. I think what I'll do is I'll have to use the good old teeth. Whew. Okay, so... Sorry about that, I'm off camera. So, everything is more or less out. Have one more piece. I could sort of pause the video, but uh, I think what I'm really doing is just being lazy. So uh, let's just get this last piece out. Um, okay. I think what I'll do is I'm doing it again. I'm being an idiot. I'm not uh, showing you what's in here. Uh, I think I wished I just sort of cut the bag off camera and uh, opened it all up. In fact, that's what I'm going to do because there's still something in here. Okay, uh, after some messing about, it was one of these one by one yellow plates that were missing. So let's see what the parts are. We have uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, about 33 pieces and two different uh, one by one round elements. Now this one with the hollow stud is 21st century as I see it. Uh, now lucky for me I knew this was happening when I ordered it so I went on Bricklink and ordered some spares so I will simply put this in here and then it is in effect a pure set. So the next thing I need to do is uh, put this in with the uh, new stuff I have, build the set and uh, show you uh, what it is when it's complete. Okay, so I've managed to uh, build it and as usual the, the light shines on the instructions but uh, this is um, the basic three stages of uh, how you build all this. Uh, we have a picture of the set and some blurred kid playing with it and a picture of part of the front. And on the reverse the uh, the usual advertisement of sets of the day. Um, now I think I have two of those individual sets. There they are on this side. Tow truck um, delivery van and everything else so 
I believe I have everything on here which I've reviewed, the exception being 622. And then there's the usual town scene, so that's that. So uh, let's have a quick look at the set. So it's a brick built figure, and he or she is uh, driving this uh, luggage train round a potential airport. And we have some representations of the uh, luggage or baggage that uh, that's going to go on that relevant plane. And um, everything is pretty much identical. You have two wheels, the base, two of these fence panels, and just random bricks to represent the luggage. And here's the uh, minifigure, if you can call it that. I think it represents a man with a cap. I'm not sure uh, how the legs work, but uh, but that's the way it is, I guess. It's pre-figure, um, so it's really, really early. It's just a fun thing to have. I mean, as a child, I would have loved playing with this as a kind of pull-along train. As an adult, it's just a lovely piece of nostalgia from back in the day when Lego was very basic and uh, very innocent. So, um, so basically, I'm really glad I've got this. Uh, the uh, seller who provided me with the opportunity to own this uh, is um, Auto Spears Man from eBay. So, I'll give him full credit for. Uh, for this I mean it's wonderful so I'm glad I've got it it'll go in the collection with everything else so um, here's the box the box itself just needs a little bit of uh, re-gluing in places which I will do after the video and uh, everything will be set for the collection so uh, so that's pretty much it really so I just lay this on its side there we are. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.